Welcome once again to The Breakfast here on PLOS TV Africa. Now let's go back in history to a pretty sad event in Nigeria in the year 2018. It was um, a period of uh, huge rains and flooding that led to the loss of more than 100 lives here in the country in uh, two different states in um, Rivers uh, Niger and uh, River Niger, sorry, and uh, Bainwe State, which overflowed. But it led to the loss of lives in Bainwe and Rivers uh, States. Um, actually, in uh, Kogi, Niger, Anambra, and Delta states, I beg your pardon. Um, the uh, NEMA at that time, um, which is an emergency body, recorded 51 deaths in Katsina State, two in Kaduna, while 30 persons were confirmed missing in Jibia, a border town in Katsina. The Kano State government also confirmed the deaths of 31 people and destruction of more than 10,000 houses during the flood in 15 local government areas in the state. Um, it was, of course, it's not the first time, I think a couple of years ago, that it, it extended all the way to Delta State and Anambra, where um, flooding had uh, made the uh, river Niger at that time overflow and um, wiped off loads of houses and property at that time. So um, 2018 was, once again, one experience that Nigeria had. Um, uh, NEMA, you know, has continued to be in the forefront I'd be, every now and then of some of these disasters um, and, of course, you know, rescued uh, people and given assistance to a couple of people who have suffered some of these disasters. But it's also very, I think it's also a good time to once again mention um, how much more needs to be done to move people to higher ground and um, climate change and what really the effects are here in Nigeria. All right, so um, our next up. Uh Today in History Story is uh, taking us back to the year 1983, September the 17th. And it's about when a woman by the name Vanessa Williams became the first black American to win uh, Miss America, the Miss America crown. Um, this was a you know watershed moment for America because um, for the first 30 years of this Miss America pageant, no black person was allowed to enter. And when she eventually entered, you know, it... it, it it really changed the game because people really wondered what a black person was doing for this Miss America Beauty crown. And um, in an interview, she mentioned that one of the organizers told her that she probably would not even win the contest. So you can imagine the shock when she eventually won this contest, September the 17th, 1983. Uh, but the sad thing about the story is that just a few weeks to the end of her reign, um, nude photos of her were leaked and she was forced to basically resign um, her Miss America title in July 1984. And that's it on uh, Today in History uh, for you on The Breakfast on Plus TV Africa. We'll take a break here and um, we'll talk more about our next topic. And we're talking basically about the IPOB situation in Nigeria and also talking about the issues of the farmers' headers clashes.